A lot of news to get to out of our state capitol tonight. First, Kansas Republicans are working to override the governor's veto of a controversial bill. Yeah, the bill in question would ban transgender athletes from girls sports. Capitol Bureau reporter Rebecca Chung tells us about the next steps. Well, that bill is now moving forward. It's heading to the House where they'll need 84 votes to override the governor's veto. The Kansas Senate making the first move with a more than two thirds majority vote. The motion prevails and the bill passes. The Kansas Senate voting 28 to 10 to override Governor Laura Kelly's veto of a bill banning transgender athletes from girls sports. Republicans arguing that biological differences create a competitive disadvantage. I'm amazed that we're not hearing from more of those who are, if you will, feminists standing up for young ladies. Now they say they're trying to level the playing field. The plan even enforcing a ban starting in kindergarten and up. Democrats say it's just a push to score political points, with Republicans in other states also passing similar measures that opponents say target LGBTQ rights. When humans don't understand something, our lack of understanding may easily move into fear. Our history is full of examples of what happens when fear drives our decisions. Now, if the House also overrides the veto. The bill will be passed into law. Then the state's High School Activities Association and the Kansas Board of Regents will decide how those rules are enforced. For now, reporting at the Capitol, I'm Rebecca Chung.